Hello and welcome back to The Retro Show. I'm Joe, if you're new around here. And make sure you click that subscribe button for weekly retro gaming content. And hit the like button if you do enjoy. This is Let's Make a Soccer Team. And actually one of my favourite PS2 games of all time um, was this, uh, Let's Make a Soccer Team. It was it was truly a fantastic game. And, uh, and hopefully you guys will enjoy it. Obviously a chairman mode, um, but also kind of a managerial game as well. Creating your own club and sticking them in the uh, any of the, the top European leagues. But let's have a little look at this intro. It always was uh, pretty good to, to watch this. So here we go. So here we are then, uh, select a league to join, so we can select the high paced, or oh, whatever it was, English league, we've got the French, German, Italian, Spanish and uh, Dutch leagues, of course we're going to go for the English leagues. Now you can pick your location in the country, um, so currently I uh, live in Greater Manchester, but I am from the North East originally, let's just have a little look. Uh, Greater Manchester, so you can go for Stockport, which is interesting. That's where I live currently, um, but uh, I'm originally from Tyne and Weir. So let's have a little look. Uh, so you can have Gateshead, Newcastle, and Sunderland. I might actually just go for Gateshead because I think Gateshead would be would be quite a cool um, a, a cool one to go for. Um, obviously across the, the River Tyne to Newcastle could have a big rivalry with them and uh, you know if you guys are interested keep hitting that like button and we may well do a full let's play on this so let's go for Gateshead um, and then we can enter the owner name so here's Joe um, so never know whether to put surname on these things because uh, modern games say what is your first name what is your surname but these old games are oh, for goodness sake uh, BS that's a little bit strong for a Peggy 3 game I probably wouldn't pass the Peggy regulations these days you will be called Joe Hanard well thank you very much I appreciate it team colour so Gateshead in real life use uh, white, so I think we'll, we'll probably still go for that. Although I do want to, to kind of morph this into South Shields eventually. So South Shields colours uh, more maroon. So yeah, let's go for that. Um, team style, I think this is by the looks of it. So we can either be counter-attacking, um, possession approach, individual play, teamwork. Um, I think we want to go for possession. Or do we? Nah, let's go counter-attacking. It's more fun, I think, counter-attacking. Oh, here we go. This is the all-important decision, of course. Selecting the secretary. So we've got uh, Rosalie... Uh, Car Carteret, who's British apparently, Sagittarius, 167 centimetres in height. You know, because height is everything. 1st of December is her birthday. Interest football. Well, that's good to know. Um, hobbies rock climbing, likes muscular men. This game was 2007, I think. Dislikes crabs. Well, we, we, we all don't like crabs. Let's, let's be honest about that. She likes muscular men, but not crabs. Well noted. <laughs> so she's outgoing, fun, kind, generous, easy to talk to. Okay. 
Jacqueline um, Michele. She's French. Uh, 16th of April is her birthday. She's very tall. She's about six foot one, by the looks of that. Six foot two, maybe. So she likes driving. Uh, hobbies: salsa dancing. She likes kittens, but dislikes violence and wars. A wild party girl, apparently, known to stay out all night long in large groups. These are very interesting descriptions. <laughs> Here we go. Leticia Torina. So she's a Virgo, 3rd of, uh, of September. Mine's the 8th of September, so we're already getting on there. Height 152, so just over 5 foot. Uh, buying new gadgets is an interest. Hobbies programming. Likes PCs. Dislikes karaoke. Well, that's, that's a point down in my book. Calm analytical. Loner, but a good shoulder to cry on after a night out. Right, and then we've got Mizato Hay Hayasaka. 15th of January, 164 centimetres tall, Japanese. Interest spirituality, she plays the piano. Sightseeing is uh, a light, and she dislikes crime. She's punctual, hard work, and strong, um, and believes in what is right. <laughs> Who do I want to go for? <laughs> I think I think this girl, Leticia Turina, she's a loner, but she is probably a bit like me. So let's go for her. Uh, but uh, I'm sure a lot of people will be going for the top two options more than likely. But here we go. We'll uh, run through the story of Gatehead Football Club. There you go then, so financial turmoil at the start of this save. William Alwyn, not ruling now, take over apparently. He's our big rival in this game. But I think it's really cool that they set up this story. Uh, and it's just a bit different, isn't it? Of course I have a strong attachment to it. Do nothing to quell the speculation on the table. Look at him. There we go. 
diving into our first bit of gameplay. Now then, 2005 to 6 season with 3. There's our secretary. This is it. Being third in the league, the playoffs are crucial for us. We don't get promoted. William Alwyn will buy the club, so let's give it our all and make sure that doesn't happen. Well, here, here. Here, here. Oh, the soundtrack, I'm feeling it. <laughs> there he is, the man himself. Today we welcome one of the biggest names in football and business, William Alwyn. Is there any truth in the rumour that you are a com that your company, Big Band Concern, is looking to move into football? Oh, he's letting go of his women. It's true, he's in talks with the club, I'm not gonna buy, and the current owner seems pretty attached to it, so we'll see how things go. Look at the people in the background, nobody's moving. That's actually quite freaky. <laughs> but let's wait until the promotion dust settles, Big Bang is on its way. Ha ha ha! I see, Big Bang, you say. Can I ask who you're in talks with? People are saying it's Gateshead United, is that right? Can you comment on that? Of course he's going to comment. Let's leave that till next year. You'll know soon enough. Anyway, my management is going to shake up the football world. Look out for the Big Bang Revolution. Okay. Such a classic Sega game, this, isn't it? Explanation of promotion requirements. Clubs place 3rd to 6th. It's League One playoffs basically. Win the title or come through the playoffs against three other teams. If you don't get promoted, your team will be put up for sale and that's game over. I did get about five seasons into a save with this uh, before it started getting very, very difficult. Uh, I had people like Ryan Giggs at the club. It was actually really cool. But, uh, it's definitely a game I'd, I'd love to, to play again properly. It's a game I've loved. And, um, you know, let me know down in the comments with that like button whether you do want to see more of this. So here we go. Here's the manager. Look at him. G Cap. Nice to meet you. I'm G Cap, the manager. I'll explain what to look for in today's match. Okay, so his attributes, strong positions, that sort of stuff. Before match starts. Okay. Now you can delegate this to the manager, so you can make it a true owner's um, owner sort of game, owner simulator, I guess. You can see us uh, in the corner there with our purple kits, and we're playing Rotherham United at the start of this uh, playoffs. Okay, so let's have a little look uh, at the player positions. Um, right. So you can see the, the attributes there. Could possibly do with a, a better striker going up head. So we've got Rash Head and we've got Grey. Yeah, I think I think Keynes will be better. Um, Quite happy to, to sort of stick with our current um, I think he looks slightly better than Carly. Okay, anyone else? Uh, no, I think that's fine. Okay, so let's go back. So team tactics. The attacking pattern. I like that one. I don't really know what was going on there. I don't really know why we can't do any of that, but hey, it's fine. Right. Okay, style. Change style. Okay, so we. I think we'll stick with the, the, the classic 442. Nice. Okay, that looks fine to me. Game plan there as well, so you can, you can 
set when you want substitutes and whatever. But I think we just want to get into a match, so let's go and do that then. Uh, let's do full. So I think, I might be wrong, but I think Barry Davis may well be the commentator in this. So English League. Ready and raring to go. So yeah, uh, you basically have to get promoted in this first little bit, otherwise it is game over. So uh, we'll try and play through most of it. Um, you know, I tend to like to have um, twenty to thirty minutes, but we shall Welcome have a look. To this big game today. No, it's Alan Green. He's a commentator. Absolutely perfect weather today. English League One. Playoff tournament. The playoffs we've been waiting for. And I'm Alan Green. There you go, live commentary. So let's get into Thank the match you. then. How these two teams line up. Gateshead. You see. Playing the usual 4-4-2. They're not going to take any risks here. Rotherham. Playing 4-5-1 today with a lone striker. Relying on the midfield, maybe picking up a goal on the break. English League One, playoff tournament. For clubs who finished third, fourth, fifth or sixth. So here we go. Gateshead on our left. Rotherham on our right. Good pass. Oh, this is a chance already for Gaines and it's 1-0. What a... What a start for us. And he's the guy that we we put on. We said he looks a little bit better. And I think we've been uh, found in that. What a what a start to the match. What a goal. And look at us. Look at the fans. All in their purple outfits. Keeper looks devastated. It's 1-0. Well, that was a... And, you know, I was speeding it up because I thought, ah, it's going to be a while before there's a chance. What a finish from Cairns there. Excellent. 1 0. Gateshead. Got a good goal, but this game could go either way. So here comes Bevan. Now Hall. This is good. And the defence easily on top of that. Oh. Trying to slow it down when something actually happens. McGiven. Rashid. Rashid. This is oh, a chance. Very northeastern name there. Luger into the middle. Rashid is there. Oh no, it's Keynes again. Keynes scores. Brilliant from uh, Keynes. And, well, one inspired decision to uh, start him today. 2 0 in this playoff match. Absolutely brilliant start for us in this save. And what a nice finish. Look how they set the move up here. Coming out of midfield. So Keynes <laughs> was just stood there, a ball hit off him, and all of a sudden he thought, ah, I better, I better have a go at this, and he did, and it's 2-0. Perfect. Williams, taking their time. Not taking any risks here. Looking comfortable in midfield here. 16, good pressure. Oaks gets it forward to Rashid now. Rashid gets it into the middle. Keynes is there, and it's a hat-trick. It's a hat trick. Absolutely amazing. I cannot believe this. And we're 3 0 up against Rotherham here. Well, I wonder. If they keep scoring like this, it's going to be a walkover. Obviously, slightly offside. I guess we'll never know, but a fabulous finish from Keynes there. And 3 0. Here's the score. Moving it nicely here. After just Not 24 minutes. Nine. Wrong ball down the middle. The referee had to give. Oh, clattered. This free kick offers a real chance. Oh, what's this? And inches Ooh. past the post. Now let's have a look at the replay. He didn't get hold of it. Just over the bar. Nineteen, good pass. 
Rashid now. Oh, terrible tackle. The free kicks a long way out. What can he do with it? It's a forward he has been given. He puts the ball across. Into the middle he has Rashid. Oh, it's a good save. Could have possibly been Williams. not taking any risks um, here. Current time is 37 minutes. Gone. Gates said. Are passing it around all right, but they're just not making the chances. They really should be. What's he on about? Oh, that's a good ball. Here's Keynes on the ball. Uh, can't quite get Excellent. through. Mullins gets it away. Now Luger. Good passing. Short ball forward now. Here's Saar. Good tackle. 15. Picks it up. This is dangerous. Oh, great save. Great save from the keeper there. So the first half is over. And half time. 3 0. An almost impossible task in the second half. So you can, of course, pick uh, your sponsors. You can pick your, your your kits. This is basically just the introduction to uh, to it. These first three matches. Um, in theory, um, you know, as long as you get through the semi-final, we're doing very, very well so far. But oh, here's Keynes. Gets it forward. Is Luger going to get there? Not quite. Twenty-five. Shame there. Here's Griffith. Now Keynes, already on a hat trick. And he wants four here. Oh, that's a terrible tackle. That's got to be a yellow card for me. They want to make the change. Mm -hmm. Substitution. Now I might actually. Uh, so what? What can I do? Can I delegate it to? I'm not entirely sure what I do here. Is it? And it's gone well wide of that left hand post. I think Square does something. Not letting them settle at all. Oh, and it goes past. Might the right be change post. tactics. That's that's exactly what I thought it might be. Okay, so I just want to delegate it to manager, um, if I can. Um, Quite remember how you do that. Never mind, it's fine. I think there is a way, but and there are gaps at the back. Easy oh. for the keeper. Ah, there we go. So we can Short ball forward now. Can they put do that? The attack together now? They've got space to work something. So nearly 70 it's minutes tight. into this match, a chance for them and. Picks it and we don't want to concede a goal. Straight down the middle. Oh, nicely cut out. It's away. Here's Seven. Sadler. Good pass. Rashid. Good passing. Current time is 75 minutes into this game. He puts the ball across. And this is a chance. Uh, good save by Hinchlu. Hinchil. No idea. Probably means he needs to be sold. He plays it back. Good pass. Moving it forward now. There's nobody there. Gets a good cross in. Well stopped. Keeper intercepts that well. You can see Luger's feeling pretty wide. tired. Plays a short Bring ball Luger wide. off. Can they put an attack together now? Two. Attack off from Mix there. Now Keynes. Now who's going to pick this up and run with it? Mm, and quite. there's the final whistle. Oh, and that's the final whistle. Well, 3 0 in this first playoff match. With that first win. So very much in charge. And hopefully we'll be able to continue that form going into the next match. Didn't let the other team into the game. So there you go. Awesome. Great start, but uh, you know we've beat them three nil. They could quite easily beat us three nil in the next match, and uh, it'll all be over. But uh, here we go. End the match. I think we go straight on to the next one. So we've got thirty eight grand from that. Happy with that one. Okay. 
straight into the next match, I think. I oh, don't know, a newspaper report. Alright, so as results, I suppose we can have a look at who else we're, we're coming up against. Top story. And just us, so Nottingham and Gillingham are the other, the other teams in it. Somebody else is coming to us now. Fatigue and condition, okay. I think go for an unchanged lineup personally. Loading times are always the issue with this sort of game. But yeah, let's just get into it. Oh, should we try a quick one? We'll see what the the score is. I'm, I'm hoping because it's 3-0 we're not going to get absolutely thrashed. But uh, <laughs> I guess I could be wrong. Oh here we go, so it's like a football manager style now. So we're in white, which is nice. Oh no, they're coming coming forward. I'm very nervous about this. <laughs> I shouldn't be. It's a game. We're actually seeing every single pass. Like team do a football manager gives you the highlights. You know when to feel nervous. This is just feeling nervous for 90 minutes. Oh, it's a free kick. Into the middle. Header down. And it's 1-0. And it's small with the goal there. It's 1-0. 4-0 on aggregate then. And we're looking almost certain to be getting through to the playoff final. Which of course we'll watch in full with uh, wonderful commentary from Alan Green. Of, uh, of all people. But... Uh, you know, this this isn't too bad for a for a quick view, if you like. You don't just sim it, which I thought it might be. Oh, good save. Looks like we're getting towards half time. Yep, half time. So switching sides. Switching sides. Come on, let's get Keynes another goal. It's a good, good ball forward, but that's the thing, we, we just seem to lose lose the ball pretty quickly. Keynes, oh, it's a great save, but we have got uh, a corner. It's coming in, header down. Oh, I thought that was going to be 2-0 there. 5-0 on aggregate, of course. It'll be interesting to see whether we play Gillingham or... or Notts Forest in the um, in the final. Yeah, I'm assuming they're not going to score four goals now, but that's a great ball forward into the middle. Well, too long on the cross. Chance. Not quite. Not quite. 20 minutes to go in this match. Great ball forward, but not good enough. Can't seem to make any sort of substitutions in this mode. Yeah, good save. And they make their third and final substitution, looking to score five goals in eight minutes. Would be mightily impressive. But it would be great to keep a second clean sheet in a row here. That's a great ball forward. Oh, I thought we had the chance there to make it 2 0 forward again and again and a chance oh it's uh, cut out by the keeper and there you go full time 5-0 on aggregate match results small assisted by Sadler gets the goal and we do progress through to the playoff final so big match coming up of course um, I think that's the World Cup ball from 2006 there Let's end the, end the match. Get 
50,000 for that. There you go. Rewards for winning. Always nice. Already making a little bit of money. Um, she's going to be coming with a result, is she? So, top story. Four clubs. So, it was nil-nil between Gillingham and Nottingham. So, Nottingham make it through at the final. Uh, back edition one. No idea what this is going to be. Ah, okay, so those ah right, so those are um, past stories, I guess. I thought it was going to be uh, back page. Here we go then. Straight into the match. I'm going to delegate it to the manager. I'm going to trust him. There we go. I trust him, he's put canes on the uh, on the bench though, so you know, in, in true Mike Ashley style, I'm gonna swap them around. So here we go, start the game, full match. We'll watch this playoff final. Bit of a longer retro show today, but I'm sure you can understand. Go then. I'm just skip past this all this intro. <laughs> if I can, I don't think I can though. I'm get a nice pan and shot of the stadium. There we go. We can skip these bits. It's a beautiful day here today. So this is the final knockout game. This stadium's witnessed so many great victories. Are they going to see another one today? So the game starts. Here we go then. Gateshead versus Forrest and Keynes is starting as he means to go on once again and fouled. And that is a yellow card for McMillian. And uh, a this chance from the free kick early on for McGiven. Ooh, just wide. Unlucky. No, let's uh, have a look at the replay. He didn't really get control of that. Couldn't keep it down, unfortunately. Looking comfortable. Going on quick. Here's Luger. 15. I'm very nervous Good we're going to lose here and it's going to be game over. Oaks gets it forward and McGiven. Right Chance McGiven in, but... And the cross just wasn't up to scratch. Small. He plays it Scored wide. in the last game, of course. Here's Sadler. Gets it forward. McGiven was there, and but... gives it away. Small doing that far out of position. And now, now who's pick this Nottingham up Forest on Good the way. Back. Here's Keynes. Oh, he fights for a that ball. And gets possession. Scored a hat trick in the first 24 minutes of the playoff semi final. What a ball forward. This is a chance for Nottingham Forest. Oh, well played from Hinchel. Oaks. And he was very quick oh, loses it. Given I thought that was a foul, but here's Rashid. He plays it wide. Now Oaks. Keynes. Not quite. Taking their time. Oops. He fights for that and gets possession. Eleven. Katoa. Not letting them settle at all. Oh, Seven. here's Sadler. He fights oh. for that and gets they Just keep possession. losing the ball, but here's Keynes. Now Rashid. Not taking any risks here. Moving it nicely here. 19. And it's half time. Nottingham Forest definitely more possession. Forward to Keynes now. This could be a possible chance, but half time. Nil nil. This could go all the way to, to penalties. Changing tactics. In game plan, you can what goes here? Mm. 
No, that's not what I want to do. Okay. Nah, cool. So there's different things you can do, but I, I'm just going to leave it up to fate in the second half. So here we go. Second half gets started. What can we expect in the rest of this game from five? He fights for that and gets possession. Here's Sadler. Gets it forward to Rashid now. Rashid forward to Keynes. Oh, it's anybody's. We just can't seem to get a shot on goal either of us. Here's Keynes though. Forward to Rashid. Chance. McGiven. Oaks. No, offside. All right, it was offside, but I think the defence can count themselves lucky. Yeah, I think they can, because that didn't look offside to me. And push forward now. We need to try and get a goal. Can they put an attack together now? Current time is 60 minutes. Gone. And that's a it's going to be a yellow card for Oaks. No yes, good. Yes, it's a yellow card. Whoops. Good pass. Five. Short ball. Offside. No doubt about it. They're offside now. Now, let's have a look at the replay. Well, it was offside, but just offside. Just, that was very close. So Griffith to Long now. Gets it offside. forward. Offside again. Crazy. Now, let's have a look at the replay. Now, that Again, was offside, just offside. A very close call. He's going to catch the back four out on one of these runs. Long ball down the middle. This is going to be a last-minute goal here. Here's McGiven. Gets it forward 50. to Keynes. No. Short ball forward. No. Not good. And he was very quick onto that pass. Nine. Well, Keynes is chasing it down. Is he going to get there? Oh well. Short ball forward now. Oh, well picked up. He's Long now to Rashid. Gets it to Keynes. Come on, let's have a chance. Keynes loses it. It's not good. Five. Rashid. Long. Fall to Luger. Luger into the middle. Here's Rashid. The chance is there. The chance. Oh. He didn't shoot. We've got five minutes left. It's surely going to go to extra time here. Now who's going to pick this up and run with it? Luga to Sadler. Long ball down the middle. Gets it forward. Rashid's there. Rashid is there. And there's nobody there. He puts the ball. Gets it in. Here's Luga. It's Keynes. Oh. He was there. He was ready. He was waiting. So the final whistle. And half. Well, final whistle goes, but it's going to be extra time. Unbelievable. We're just going to continue on with these players. So the first half for the best. Gets so will we see something special in this half? Oh, here's Kane straight away. I don't know why he passed it back, but here's Sadler. Kane's now. Oh. Into this game. Gateshead. Are passing it around all right, but they're just not making the chances. Oh, here's Kane's. Here's Kane's. He shoots, but it was blocked. Picks it up. Oh. Not taking any risks here. Five more minutes of this first half of extra time. Now who's going to pick this up and run with it? That's gone out for a throw. Nottingham looking to bring a substitute on. Four takes the throw. Went past him, no, didn't no, miss a no, step. No, 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 no. Forward now. Fantastic pass. Oh, it's away. Here's Luger now. Oaks. So, the whistle ends. The and it's away. Still no result. Second and not much time half. left in extra time now. And we're into the second half of extra time. The minutes ticking oh, away. Keynes, what are you doing, He's son? Oh, McGiven, sorry. Do we go for a goal? I think we do. We don't really want this to go down to penalties. Throw it. It's anybody's. Ten. Oh, well picked. Chance. Up. He that. Oh. Ten. Here's Rashid. Now Keynes. He finds the space. To Rashid. Rashid. The ball goes free. What are you doing? 
Now, who's going to pick this up? This has just been a really oh. poor performance, but here's Rashid. We have a chance. What's he doing? He just keeps running with it. Luger into the middle. Keynes, and that was the chance. A free header. Six yards from goal. Look at this. Luger got it in. Keynes was there. Oh, that should have been it. And a hit off the bar. Well, is that going to be how close we get to promotion? It's full time. It's penalties. And still no definitive result after extra time. It's going to be decided on penalties. <sighs> Let's go. Let's hope. Rashid takes the first penalty and, that and scores. So 1 0. Some other way to settle games. Cronin. That and what looks like the Brazil kit. What a save from the keeper. To keep now Keynes scored a hat-trick in the semi-final. Missed that final chance and it has just got through. Katoa now. Can we save this? This would give us some breathing room. Well, Nine. the right way. We're we'll giving now. Oh, and he blew it. oh no, he misses Nine. it. The keeper this now. is horrible to watch. Harley now. That... Oh, what a save! What a save that is! That was world class. Luger now, chance to put us two in front. Oh, nice. Nicely done. And this needs to go in for Nottingham Forest. Roland. Lovely. This is our chance to win promotion. It's Sadler. So near and yet so far. They just. No room for Missed by a mile. Price now with a chance to level for Nottingham. Oh, and he's missed. So by virtue of them missing their penalty, we have won promotion. The ones who go through there. Absolutely brilliant. So the playoffs are over, and the team that goes up gets it. Well, there you go. We get through. We are promoted, and that is a wonderful feeling. We'll see what sort of uh, thing comes up here. Um, I'm sure there'll be some sort of story mode action as we end the match. Just about win on penalties. There you go. We get some good, good money in there. So top story. Sports page. No idea. And there we go. So we're playing in the championship uh, league next year. So you can save progress, which is good. So I th I'm pretty sure from this point you can um, change the, the club's badge and colours and stuff. And uh, well, there you go. There's congratulations on promotion and you can edit things. So there you go. That is where we're going to leave it for today. And it is open to you guys. Do you want to see a full series of this or at least a few more videos on it? Let me know by hitting that thumbs up button down below as well as... Um, the comment section subscribe to the channel for weekly retro gaming content i hope you guys are having a wonderful day thanks for watching and goodbye